has to be organic, but I was telling you that uh, it's almost been a month and I've had no headaches. Mm -hmm. A whole month. And uh, some of the main things I've I changed in my uh, diet is I, I limit my coffee now. I used to drink a nice big cup and it still was fine, you know. But by the time, by like three, four, five o'clock, I would be going downhill like a big crash. And I wouldn't even put sugar in my coffee. Mm. But I don't know. But about a month ago, I tried. I started switching out coffee for organic herbal teas. So I'll and then when I drink the tea, I like I um double or triple the tea bags, mm. and I let it steep in there. So I'll have a nice big cup of tea in the morning, and I'll usually wind down the day with a caffeine-free tea. Um, with at least two bags in them as well, so I can really stock up on um, the antioxidants and all the benefits of tea. And then, so I'm limiting my sugar a lot more. I had some sugar yesterday, but I was fine, so I don't know. But I limited that. Um, and oh yeah, so I think one of the biggest things is in the morning, I don't eat much. So my morning really is a big cup of herbal organic tea. And then usually I won't eat until Maybe like 11.30, right around lunchtime. And then, um, and I think I just spread out the eating. I eat little portions. And we've eliminated, like, we don't eat that much rice anymore. I don't know. And then, so, like, the carbs are limited. And then I found this whole vitamin B12 energy natural. So, energy packs that I found at Costco and rapid hydration i forgot what and two of these actually can replace your multivitamins for the day is what they said so i only can do about half for the day and that usually gives me like you know energy with good this is all half is good because it's a lot of vitamin b12 and a lot of potassium but it really it does hydrate. So I think maybe one of my biggest issues is I could have been dehydrated. Mm. You know, so me drinking a big herbal tea in the morning and in the evening and trying to drink water throughout the day. And then this is a hydrating factor. So, and coffee dehydrates you. Mm. So it's, it's a natural dehydrate. So I'm just learning my body. Oh, I can't forget this tip too. I've been once a month, I'm getting a deep tissue massage. I decided in my brain, I was like, after I went to that Chinese lady in the mall, her name is Tina. After I went to that Chinese lady in the mall, I've seen a big difference. So usually I'll go the beginning of the month, every single month now. She's only like a dollar per minute. So I usually do 20 to 30 minutes. Um, and doing that massage once a month, I could do more. Eventually, I'd like to graduate to once a week. But once a month so far, that alone, and hers are deep tissue. Like, she really gets in there. And since I've been going to that place, that's probably the combination of eliminating the coffee and doing a deep tissue massage and um, just staying more hydrated has been what's worked for me. I've been a whole month, no headaches. And that's rock star. And that's all I have to say about that.